Hey, how's it going ladies and gentlemen of the internet? My name is Doodles, we are back once again with a brand new video for you guys. And today I am starting my Resident Evil 2 remake Claire playthrough. I've already completed the Leon story on the game. It's on the channel already, so you want to go and check that out if you haven't already. It's a super awesome playthrough and it was so much fun. This game is a dream come true for me and I am so excited to start playing it again for you guys. Hopefully you guys are just as excited as I am. If you are, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up if you're new around here. Make sure you subscribe with notifications on. Click the subscribe button, click the notification notification bell and click all that way you'll never miss out on a video goes live on the channel including my Claire Redfield playthrough and then the second run playthroughs of both characters and every other extra that is in the game as well so without further ado let's just dive straight into the Claire story Resident Evil 2 remake let's do it Man, I am so hyped. I cannot express enough how hyped I am. The Leon playthrough is absolutely fantastic, and I cannot wait to see what Claire's got in store for us. Uh, me and Sherry, and that's going to be awesome. So hyped for it. Let's get into this opening cutscene, then let's get it on. Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, oh, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You got to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse, like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, they'll sink their teeth in you. I saw a taxi, buddy. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. Sleep. Oh, shit. I'll be fine. Sounds good. I'll be back as soon as I find Chris. I will, but I gotta go. Why does everyone think I'm gonna get in trouble? What the? Hello? So right, here we go. Time to finally uh, get control of Claire. Obviously, Leon is already in there. We're going to go and uh, see what he's up to. Or is it different in this playthrough? Oh, no, maybe not. Anybody here? Okay, it must be different, obviously, being a uh, Claire story. We see it from her side rather than Leon doing this bit so yeah my mistake Hello? maybe that's the B scenarios that we dare uh, do stuff like that are you okay wait here I'll check it out right just go see what's uh what's caused that man a bit of a uh, bit of pain I think we've got a pretty good idea what might have caused that? Excuse me, is everything okay? Stay back, man. I got this. No, you don't, mate. No, you don't. Get off him! I said get off him! 
Oh, brutal. Don't come any closer. Oh, we have a we have a gun. I didn't know I didn't know Claire had a gun straight away. God, he does not want to die. I don't know if he's fully dead or not. But we'll grab this key. I'm sure it'll have some use for it. Right, it's the gas uh, the storage room. Right, so now we need to try and find that. I'm assuming it's going to be this one. Oh shit. It's like a nightmare. Oh shit, we need to get ourselves out of it. Oh, that was close. We need to get out of here quick. No, don't shoot. Get down. We gotta get out of here. You alright? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy really shit. I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. You live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. We are getting into Resident Evil 2 Remake. I am super hyped for it. I'm glad that uh, we got to experience that opening section with Claire rather than Claire walking in to find Leon already dealing with it. Like I said, it might be different in the B scenario, but that's exactly what we did in the Leon scenario just with Claire this time. It's going to be really cool. I don't know what's going to happen when we get out of the car, when, when we start going into the Raccoon City, whether we're going to do basically Leon's story, but with Claire, or whether it's going to be the other side of the fence I don't know yet. That might be the beast scenario. Only time will tell, but I'm super excited to find out. And I cannot wait to get further in this game. Man, I love this game. It is a true masterpiece in every sense. It's truly amazing. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. The police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Like we're walking from here. More like running. Yeah, good thinking, Claire. Get out. 
Get out now! I can't! Hold on! Okay? Yeah! I'm all right! What about you? I can't stay here! It's not safe! Oh, shit. Go on ahead! I'll meet you at the station! Oh, shit. We need to get ourselves out of here. And quick. I can't stop. We gotta keep moving. Good thinking, Claire. Good thing, and we're just getting the fuck out of here. This is not good. The zombies in our tail. It's like the end of the world. Right, come on. Just through this alleyway. Hopefully, the police station isn't too far. Looks pretty similar to Leon's playthrough. Actually, I think it is pretty much the same playthrough kind of that Leon did. Like, sort of how Claire A and Leon A in the original were very similar. You can stay away from me, you fat fuck. No, you stay away. Right, there we go. We're safe for now. Right, it's rock and roll. Right, we're going to discard the key here. We don't have to carry that now. Uh, we've got some ammo. That'll come in handy. Come on, Chris. Where are you? Oh, shit. They're inside, too. David! Marvin! You there? I found a way out. It's in here. Send reinforcements. East hallway. I should help this guy. Right, we know our way off too. Rock and roll. Focus, Claire. Focus. Right, yeah, it's got some ammo. Awesome. Claire's gun only got five shots. I'm assuming it's probably more powerful guns. It looks a bit like a magnum. What is it? It's a SSL handgun, yeah. Oh, it's a nine millimeter, but it looks a bit I don't know. Bit more like a revolver. I think it was more like a revolver than a magnum. Sorry, my bad. It looked more uh, revolver-ish, but uh, I'm assuming it could be potentially be a bit more powerful because only having five bullets in the in the, the chamber isn't going to be great against zombies at all. Like Leon's gun had like about nine to start off with. I think it fully upgrades to about twenty-four, and uh, that was quite difficult at times to be able to uh, take out zombies. So I'm ha I really hope that the gun's a bit more powerful at least to counteract it. Right, let's rescue Elliot. Hurry up! Hurry up! Don't finish! Larry, give me your hand! Help me! Hold on! Give me your, give me your other hand! Oh, 
That's pretty damn fucking brutal. Not gonna lie. Right, so we've got the officer's notebook. Obviously, it tells us about the statue, that that's how we get underground in order to get out of here. And it's got the three puzzles there, which we need to solve uh, later on. So, right, let's head back to the main hallway. Let's get out of here. Hopefully, we can uh, not take any hits. That would be ideal. Right, so far, so good. Let's get ourselves out of here to safety. Watch out! You all right? Yeah. You're safe. For now. Marvin Branagh. Thanks. Obviously someone taught you well. Yeah. I know how to take care of myself. Come on. <clears throat> so nobody knows what caused this? There's a lot of theories. But all I know for sure is that this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, hey, keep that on. Just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You're really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. Left weeks ago. Vacation? Let's... That's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. <gasps> hey. Uh, hey, we should probably get you to a hospital. Oh, 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 forget about me. I can take care of myself. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're gonna need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. No. You'll probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're Shh. gonna... And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can. Or you run. So right, there we go, we've got the combat knife and now we can um, progress through the police station. I'm actually gonna drop one of these first aid sprays off into the, um, the item box, just to be on the safe side, because I don't really need to carry them both. And obviously we haven't got a great deal of storage space, so we'll put one there just to make things uh, a little bit easier. So we've got a little bit more space, just in case we come across anything. Uh, but I actually think that is gonna be a good time to wrap up this video, guys. We've been going just under 20 minutes now. Uh, the last time I, when I did Leon's uh, video, I tried to do the whole one-shot demo stuff in one video, and the video turned out about 40-something minutes long, which is quite long for you guys, so I don't want you guys to get bored. So I think the sort of small 20-minute sort of videos is definitely the way to go. And so hopefully you guys enjoyed this one today. If you did, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up if you're new around here. Make sure you subscribe with notifications on. Click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, then click all. That way you'll never miss out on a video goes live on the channel. If you do miss any, any videos, there's a playlist in the description box of the Claire player through and in, on the screen for you guys now. So make sure you go and check them out. My name is Dills. I thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.